Welcome to another edition of the Smart Budget Channel. And today we'll be doing a Amazon product review of the W Sky flashlights. These two flashlights that come in a two pack, and this is the S2000 model. I'd like to thank uh, the company for sending me these flashlights to do a product review on these, try them out, see how they work out. And I do have to say, for a budget friendly two pack flashlight set, this is a pretty nice set to have. And again, you get two in a box. Box looks like this. You get your operation guide here. And you have two options with these flashlights. You can either go three AAA batteries, pop them in there, or you can actually you get this tube with it, but not the battery, but you do get the tube, and you can uh, put a 18650 battery rechargeable in the flashlight instead. So it's compatible either way. So what I did is I went ahead and grabbed one of those rechargeable batteries, popped it in this one versus the AAA. And I'm outside right now and what I did is I set a uh, reflective vest about 33 feet from where I'm at to show the difference between the, the lighting. And you have modes. You got high, medium, low. You got strobe and you got SOS on this. So you got five modes and you got your orange button so it's easy to see in low light conditions you get a lanyard with it also what I like about this uh, you get a clip so you can just clip it onto your belt clip it to your backpack it's a nice strong clip also what I like about this it's got zoom abilities on the light itself let me get this a little bit closer here So you can uh, have a broad light, like if you need to light up your backyard, you can do that. Or if you need it more focused, you can zoom this in by pushing it up, and you got that. So as you can see, I got the S2000. This has a rechargeable battery here, and we'll try that first, and then we'll switch to the AAA option, and I put fresh batteries in there. So we'll try both of them. Let's go ahead and try this one first. I wish the camera would do it more justice. It's it is picking up the reflection there. And I'm lighting up the backyard here. And it's easily shooting over 75 feet for visibility here. All the way to the fence line. Unfortunately, the camera doesn't capture that far out. But as you can see here, when we zoom it in, you have you can adjust it how you want. Zoom it in all the way has a focus beam that's shaped as a square and what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna point it towards the reflective vest which is 30 feet feet away 33 feet away from where I'm standing as you can see it's the camera picks it up no problem nice focus beam there picks up the reflective vest easily on the camera and again, it's zoomed out. Up the tree, down, along the fence line, down to the ground, and then we focused out. And of course, as you can see here, again, you get your operation manual. Comes in a two-piece box set like this. Super bright, five modes, zoomable design, waterproof, shock resistant, and AAA option. So we'll go ahead and try the AAA option and we'll do a side by side comparison. But first, let me show you how, how this looks. And here it is at its highest mode. If you use a rechargeable battery, it's just a tad brighter. Not much brighter, but just a little bit. And again, I'll focus it in. I'm going to point out towards where the reflective vest, the camera can barely pick it up. And here we go. In focus mode. And there you have it. 33 feet from me. Very bright. Very, very bright. I wish I can show the tree line higher. It's barely hitting the wire, but... It, 
yeah that's more like 80 feet and doing the backyard no problem with that and let's do a side-by-side -side comparison here get the other one here okay on my right side you got the rechargeable and on the left side you got the AAA battery like I said very close but I I would have to say that the, using a rechargeable battery is just a tab bit brighter just a little brighter not much but if you're gonna use a flashlight like this any type of high lumen light uh, flashlight you're going to use you definitely going to go rechargeable because you'll burn through a lot of batteries if you always have it in high mode but i will show you the features here see how the camera picks them up okay of course you got your high mode medium low your strobe sos And then back to high I do like that it is flat here so there's no accidental push in on there some of these uh, flashlights they have a prone to stick out on their button and it's always an accidental push but this one's very flush with here so there's no push on it let me get a close look at this again just so you can see again you get your lanyard and you got your clip your housing is inside you take the, this part off and you can get to your batteries take a look at the LED in there as you can see here you got a DNA catcher right here very nice so if you had to use it as a defensive weapon you have to jab somebody with it you could do that with that and again it being super bright this is a great budget friendly type of flashlight again two of them you keep one in your car one at home you know so it comes in a two pack and we'll break down the a little bit about uh, a little bit of the features of this particular uh, flashlight again this is the S2000 model. It it's, uh, weighs 11.2 ounces. Product dimensions are 5 by 1 times 1.3 times 1.1 inches. It's a medium sized tactical black flashlight. High strength aluminum. Thickness is 1.1 inches. Battery powered. 3.7 volts, 5 watts. It's got an upgraded LED in it. 1.26 inches. High lumens, zoomable, water resistant, five operations modes, high, medium, low, flash, strobe, SOS, emergency, pocket, pocket friendly, weather and shock resistant, lightweight and pocket size, easy to use, anti-roll body, which is really nice. You don't want it like putting it on your hood and it just rolls right off since it's got the anti-roll body on it. Uh, tactical tail switch, uh, usage, uh, patrolling, camping, hiking dog walking, hunting, boating, power outages, emergency, general purpose, everyday carry, backup, survival, car home, outdoors, indoors, work. And again, you can use uh, three AAA batteries or you can use the battery tube and put in a rechargeable battery that's 18650 battery. And those are the basic features of the flashlight and dimensions and product uh, description of this and I do have to say it's great light works well haven't had any issues with it and again I'm definitely going to keep one at home one in the car I think that'll work well for me and uh, again it's just if you're looking for some budget friendly flashlights this is uh, one way to go and I'll put it to, I'll put a link in the description box so you guys can click on it it'll take you straight to Amazon and where to buy this product and if you guys have any questions please drop it in the 
uh, comment section below and I'll try to answer any of your questions and again this is a smart budget channel if you're new to the channel please hit the subscribe button below we do budget friendly product reviews here anywhere from prepper items to household items and everything in between we also do a seasonal EDC series which stands for everyday carry and this is a great everyday carry item if you're into flashlights we also do uh, some personal finance talk here we do uh, product reviews from the retail sector as well as Amazon and eBay. And uh, we also do DIY projects that can save you some money. We do life hacks here that can save you some money. And if you're interested in any of those subjects, again, please hit the subscribe button below. And for all my returning subscribers, stay smart, stay on budget, and have a great day.